Hi YouTube, I'm back. And today is Friday, March 6, 2020. And um hope everybody's having a great day today. Uh it has been a long week for me, so I'm glad today is Friday. I've had a rough week. Um and today I had to uh I had a doctor's appointment earlier. And fortunately, my husband was able to be off work to go with me because he had been working a lot lately because they had let some people go, which caused him to have to work more hours. But, um, yes, I'm, I'm glad to be back home. But my husband went with me to the doctor's appointment, and after we left there, we had to, you know, go some, run some errands like Sam's and places like that. And then he decided that he wanted to surprise me and take me out for a little shopping. So I was so excited. So I went to Bath and Body Works and I went to Yankee Candle. Finally, I get to Yankee. Um, and I want to share you share with you guys what I got um, from Bath and Body and Yankee Candle. Um, I also went to World Market. So I'll probably share with you what I got from there too. So, let's get started. We'll start out with um, Bath and Body Works. And I went there and I picked this candle up called Sunny Lime. I really do like the packaging here. This candle smells really, 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 really good. Um, Bath and Body Works have gone up, guys, on their prices. <laughs> and um, we had a 20% off coupon and a coupon for a free item so yeah so the scent notes on this is fresh squeezed lime juice white peppercorn bright bergamot with essential oils all right the next one i picked up is linen shores and i really like this scent too um i'm i'm starting to step outside of my comfort zone this year in 2020 and this also has one of those nice tops to it. I, I just love these. These are really cute for um, the summer months. And this is Sun Wash Cotton Pacific Sea Spray Beach Jasmine Fresh Coconut with Essential Oils. That one smells really, really good. And then I picked up some hand soaps and I picked up the, it looks like the frost, some, of, some in the frosted bottles. And the first one I got is Honolulu, Honolulu Sun. And the scent notes on that is a Fresh Island Coconut, Pacific Palm, and Driftwood. The next one I picked up is Bamboo Paradise. And it is um, Dewy, Ivy, Musk, and Blonde Sandalwood. Okay, I'm making a mess. <laughs> Look as per usual. Okay, the next one I picked up is a favorite of my husband's, and that's the Waikiki Beach Coconut. I like this one too, and so does my kids, but my husband just loves the scent. Um, dragon Fruit, Water Bamboo, and Coconut Jasmine. All right, the next one is a favorite of a lot of people. Um, it's Island Margarita. I love this scent too. It's fresh squeezed lime and sea salt. And the next two that I picked up, she said that they were out of the candles in this scent. So I just grabbed the hand soaps and that was Coastal Air. And the scent notes on these are Water Lily, Sun Drenched Lime, and Lavender. This smells really good. I was kind of disappointed that they were out of the um, candles. All right, and then I picked up in um, hand sanitizers. These will be gone next week, as you all know, my daughter is a germaphobe. And I picked up the Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. I got two of those. I got a Waikiki Beach Coconut. I got a Hawaiian Pink Hibiscus. And I picked up a koala cooler melon cooler so i got those and then my free 
item. I had a coupon. It was free item up to $14.50. I just grabbed the Pretty in a Peach. Uh, pretty as a Peach body lotion. Lord knows we don't need no more Bath and Body Works lotion and stuff. But I'll put that in my gift um, container. And it'll be somebody's gift for a birthday or Mother's Day or maybe even Christmas. Because <laughs> um, I collect gifts all year long. And that was everything that I got from Bath and Body Works. Um, I'm like I said, I'm really liking the packaging on those candles. I think it's very pretty. All right, next um, is Yankee Candle, and um, Yankee Candle had quite a few coupons. That you get the free tumbler. Um, they had the buy one get one. You can get up to three, um, and then they had. Um, the 20 off of 50 little think card things that I had um, where you can buy $50 worth and get $20 off. So at our Yankee Candle, our um, manager there, she always, you know, tries to help us get the best of the best for our money. So we did a couple of transactions so that we could get a free tumbler each time and um, we could use the coupons, you know, the way we wanted to. So um, that worked out. So the first thing I coupon I used was the 20 off of 50. And I used that on accessories. So I will show you what I picked up in accessories. The first thing that I picked up is this. That is so, so, so cute. And you put large jars in there. I just have paper in there. Well, she put paper in there when we bought it. Um... And I just haven't taken it out. And that was $20. That is so cute to me. I love that um, watering can. The next thing I picked up were these cute little boots. And they were $10 each. Well, it would help if I turn them right side up. Okay, and the next thing I picked up, which I love, is the cute little birdie. And the little birdie was $10. So I spent 50 there, and then it took um, 20 off. And then I also got a free tumbler, and the tumbler that I chose was the homemade herb lemonade. It smells really good, and this is part of the Garden Hideaway collection. Okay, I'm going to make some space here. All right, the next transaction that we did was where you buy three and you get three free. And really, essentially, what it boils down to is you pay for the three most expensive ones, and then you get three free. Well, the Elevation Candles were included in this deal. So what I did is I bought three, we got three medium jars of the new scents and then we just picked up three large jars of the elevation because the large elevation candles are 25 and the medium jars are 20, I think they're like 26.50 or something like that each. So let me show you what I got in the medium jars. The sweet pea mandolines these this this right here smells amazing it's it has a bakery note um to it and it smells so good i really like this scent it kind of puts you in mind of the candle that they came out with called rainbow cookie if you guys remember that one kind of smells like that now this next one i'm stepping outside of my comfort zone the roseberry sorbet i typically don't move in the direction of florals that much but this smells really really good um it definitely has a rose scent to it but um i don't know if i'm going to keep this one or maybe give this one to my mom and put this in a gift for her because she can do florals. I really it 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 is it's a touch and go for me. I'm gonna say that. <laughs> it's a touch and go. Like I said, the first one that I showed you, the sweet pea um mandolines, that's that's bakery all the way to me. And this one here, 
is the fresh lime cilantro this is more of a citrus and i love the way that lime smells anyway this one smells really good so i think that i will definitely enjoy this one but that roseberry sorbet yeah that may be passed along to my mom possibly because like i said she can do those scents all right those are the three that i purchased then i got these three for free and um the first one i got is in the elevation large jar and this is the kumquat and orange and this candle right here smells amazing i love it and the thing i like most about elevation candles is that they really do put out you don't have to search for the scent because this it puts out the next one that i picked up is the rice milk and honey another winner for me i love the way it smells love 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 the way this candle smells so yes that's another winner for me and last but not least in the free candles i got a oldie but goodie this one has been around dark berries this one smells amazing i just finished burning a dark berries that i had purchased last year a couple of days ago i burned it down to nothing until it just went out on its own that candle smells good and it will send up your whole entire space okay and then if you spent at least $25 you got another candle for 10 and that was this calamansi cocktail and this smells really good um, this will be nice to burn um, as the weather breaks and the free candle that I got with that purchase was the sweet pea and mandolines I got this one for my mom actually because I think she'll like that scent and then my husband I'll show you real quick what he picked up he had to get something too so he got two of these um, the dark berries and the small jars and then he picked up sun sunlight sands and our um yankee they were like everybody is going crazy of that sunlight sense i to me it's a little too perfumey i get a perfumey scent i i'm not a fan of it but a lot of people i've seen a lot of people who are fans of it and the last one that he got is passion flower and again that floral that's in there is probably a bit much for me and the free candle that he picked out was sweet pea and mandolines. All right, last but not least, I'll show you what I got from World Market. It's just really a small amount um, of stuff, but I just thought I'd share it. The first thing I picked up at World Market is this cute little mug to drink out of. You guys know I love mugs and things like that. Look at it on the inside. And I said, oh, I can have a hot cup of tea in this. And I paid, well, my husband paid $8.99 for it. That felt so good not to spend any of my own personal money today. All right, and then I picked up these earrings. And these were $4.99. I love these. Now, my daughter is going to love these. She's going to try to take those from me. And the next pair that I picked up are these which I thought they were super cute and they were also $4.99 and last but not least this is no big deal I picked up some tea filters um, if you've watched some of my tea videos you know I drink a lot of loose tea so I'm gonna try these um, to see how they do um, as far as steeping the tea and everything and that is it. That is all the hauls, guys. That's everything. And I hope you guys are excited that today is Friday. I hope you're looking forward to an amazing weekend. I plan to catch some rest. Um, I'm a little tired. Like I said, I had a rough week. Um, but today was a great day. I do have to go to the grocery store tomorrow. I should have went ahead and went today while my husband was off. But that Sam's Club trip just did me in. I... Going in those places like that and getting all that stuff is okay, but Lord have mercy, it wears you out. So I'll make a meal plan and a 
list tonight and get up in the morning to go to the grocery store. When I get back home tomorrow, I just plan to sit back and relax, drink some hot tea, maybe read a little bit, and I might watch something on Disney Plus or Netflix. <laughs> Um, I need to catch up on my Dateline episodes, so I may do that. Just depends. Well, thank you guys for tuning in, and I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Be blessed. Bye now.